Katie at the Stuff Show for Shiny Shiny and Tech Digest. I'm here with Daniel, who's uh, representing LG. The big product announcement today was the new Blu-ray player from LG. So, uh, Daniel, do you want to tell us a quick bit about the, um, the player and what's so special about it? The uh, Blu-ray player we have here today is the BD100. Uh, the Blu-ray itself uh, is able to play Blu-ray, but also it'll take your existing DVD collection and upscale it to a quality oh, right, okay. of Blu-ray. I struggle with and still do even though I've had so many um, press events about the subject. This is a 1080p. Why is that different to 1080i? It's all to do with lines and dots, isn't it? Yes, the Blu-ray can send us. Before you answer, yes. this has to be so simple that anyone can understand it. Okay. And this is your challenge. <laughs> the difference between the two is that uh, you have 1080i, which is 1080 of interlace, and then you have 1080p, which is 1080 progressive. And the difference Interlace puts one set of lines across, then followed by another. So there's a bit of flickering that goes on between the two. Right. The rest of the scan displays all the lines at the same time, so it gives a better image okay. and a better quality. Right. So, that's the difference between the two. so this is better because it's a P? Yeah. Well, yes, it does, it does put 1080p and uh, it will also do 1080i, but it all depends on what TV you're displaying it on. Okay. You can't display 1080p at outputs, you know, outputs onto a TV that's only two. So what do you recommend to anyone, some poor innocent member of the public wants to go in and buy a high definition touch TV and a Blu-ray player? How do you know what to get? It's so hard to know what to pick. Especially because there's all kinds of new HD coming out that are even, even better and going to be even more. What, what do you do? What do you advise? Well, the best thing to do is to go for a TV that's HD ready. When you go for really large screens, and we're talking of screens that are like 50 or 60 inch screen yeah. sizes, considering to go for a TV that has what we call full HD or 1080p. Yeah. Um, small screen sizes, general consumers aren't really going to notice a difference, but it may mean something to some people to have that. So, but the, the key thing is to go for a TV that is HD really, and that's what LG is committed to to ensure that all their TVs are HD. Are you sticking with Blu-ray, or are you uh, looking at uh, the HD? LG um, is looking at Blu-ray from the same perspective, yeah. and we also do develop HD DVD as well from a computing perspective. So we have the ability to switch it into Blu-ray, but we feel very confidently that Blu-ray will be the preferred option for the home okay. entertainment. Is that a promise? Yeah. We have to. It's the consumer that gets to decide okay. which format we right. go with. So. Okay. So it's left to us to uh, work out if we understand what's going on but uh, I'm sure it will be resolved at some point uh, and hopefully uh, you're a little bit clearer about that. Personally, I'm still completely clueless. All I know is this looks fantastic.